Oh, don't you worry. I'm wearing my headphone don't like the squishy sloshy sound of this what's up everyone my name is swift edge aka braid young and welcome to tangal a filipino horror game based around a folklore of their own version of a vampire called the mananangal and seeing this on itchio i was like you know what i want to play it because me, I've always been intrigued by supernatural style monsters and monsters that are around different parts of the world and just seeing because, you know, what every I think every country almost has their own version of a vampire and what it looks like. And seeing the fact that because I looked up the one day because, you know, writing the books I do, um, I wanted to see what different version of the creature works. Now, in the Philippines, the Mananangal is like a half like cut in half kind of vampire creature it's got like it can actually separate itself at the stomach like it can go from like having legs walking around like it i feel like that's the way it looks because it's like it can pass for human then all of a sudden it reveals its monstrous nature by breaking in half wings sprouting from the back and it just attacks and it's really a horrific look at what we normally see as like a beautiful vampire and it reveals itself to be such a monstrous looking thing when you look at the pictures of how they depict the mananangal oh it looks scary it looks weird and it's so cool to see but i want to play this game i want to see the mananangal I've been wanting to take Vanessa to the Philippines for a long time now I want to go it's the country where my father grew up and it seemed only right that my wife should see it as well. I just wish it had gone differently. Hi, Lucy. Hi, Lucy. I'm heading out for a bit. Heading out for a bit. I'll be back soon. I'll be back soon. Sure, honey. Sure. See you later. See you later. I love you. I love you. Love you too. Love you too. All right. When she didn't come back, I went looking for her. Naturally. But my flashlight stopped working, and before I knew it, the ground gave way. Oh no. So I'm assuming that's how we got into the mine. Oh, see, that's a good representation, like, of the fact that the creature can just split right in half. Uh, how long was I out? Long enough. Oh no. Oh, no it's way so I'm beautiful up there, up though. Also, the some of my closest friends are uh, from the Philippines, and just the way they describe how the country looks, I really want to go and see it. <laughs> and I would love to lo learn about like all the different folk tales they got there and everything, and I think it'd be so cool. But then there's part of me of just like you know, when I play horror games that are based on like being in a different country, part of me is like you know, I don't really want to <laughs> go. But then again, like we have our own. I think we all, we have our own creature tales within Canada that makes me go. Eh, I don't want to be here either. <laughs> Because we have weird creatures here. I mean, there's a lot of creatures in uh, America, too. Like, the New Jersey Devil and Mothman. Like, so I feel like every... I hate tight spaces. I don't really have an aversion. I don't have claustrophobia. Um, ooh, this is creepy. But, like, it's definitely interesting learning about, like, the different... Great. Whoa. I need more batteries. That lasted just a few seconds. Whoa. I thought this... Is this like a mine or... Because this just looks like a really deep cavern. Maybe hey, hey, hey! Ah, there we go. Let's reload this bad boy. I might... Good lord. Why do you take forever to reload that? I'm not one for keeping a journal. Hold on. I'm not... I'm not one for keeping a journal, but I feel like if I don't write this down, it's going to gnaw on me for the rest of the week. There's something down here with us, I'm sure of it. At first, I thought it was just the bats, but I've never seen bats that big before. Maybe all the extra hours I signed up for how... I... My not being able to read properly is starting to kick in. Maybe all the extra hours I signed up for have started getting to me. I haven't told the others yet. I don't want the boss to fire me for starting trouble. Hmm. Is that an elevator? Wait, what? Could be my way out. How do you... How can you see that over there? It's too dark for me. Um, can I press escape and adjust the settings? I can't do that. 
Uh, Brainhead. Did that help now? Hold on. Okay, it doesn't. I don't have to apply anything. Oh, I can see something over there. But no, I definitely think it'd be great to go and like visit all these other countries. Why is it when I start speaking, something happens? So it's a generator. Make sure the fuel tank is attached properly before starting the generator. Well, no, duh. It needs fuel. There's a lot of scratch marks on there. Okay, so I'm assuming then we're right there based on that. So there's two generators from the looks of it. Yeah. Okay. Caution signs, great. Love it. Thank you for letting me know. Kind of figured that out. Well, yeah, so that's what I'm talking about. The Mononongo, like, it can split. I never wanted to believe in you and those like you. If I did, how could I ever hope to feel safe again? But now, after what I've seen, I have no choice. Alejandro says that you are real and I believe him. He also says that we need to show you respect and that is what I intend to do. And respect. How that feels what? much better. What is that? A mananangle. Well, mananangle? My grandma used to tell me stories. I think I'm saying it wrong. Thing. This is like a little shrine to it. Balul. My grandma used to have one of these in her living room. They're supposed to be protectors. Yeah, cause see, I'd love to go and like travel to other countries. And learn about all these different things, like all the different folk tales, and like, cause every country they have, every country has it. And like, and it's one thing to learn it. Why is it so heavy? Because it's a full jug of gasoline. That's red now. I don't like that. I actually hate that. Gasoline. This should do it. Um, it's one thing to learn over Google and everything, but, like, actually going, because going to the actual countries and learning about this stuff. Just because, like, the one book I'm writing, I want to talk about more different monsters from around the world and everything, and all these different creatures and tales and everything, and almost give them, like, a realism kind of thing. Well, we're not going that way now. And, like, actually talk to people and learn about it. Because, I mean, Google is great and all, but Google can... <gasps> but it doesn't give you, like, a real perspective thing. Because there's always, like, you're going to find people... I don't know what I'm saying at this point, but I feel like you would actually meet people that would be like, Oh, yeah, no, I've encountered the thing. And you'd be like, really? Do tell. I want to know. Oh, just be able to travel and learn about this stuff. 1998. Oh, this is old. Well, wait, what's the setting of the game right now? Where are, what, what time setting? What year is it? <laughs> am I going the right way or am I, I, am I going the right way? I just like knowing things about monsters. That's all I'm saying. And Google doesn't do much. I'm now very terrified. I said that and my phone went off because it's a Google phone. My phone's like, you talking about me? You you talking trash? What was that? I was like, did I just die? Wait, is the creature is the creature around here? What's happening? I couldn't keep quiet about it anymore. The others deserve to know. I've seen it multiple times in this mine now. Closer and closer each time. My coworkers need to know to be careful and to stay in the light. Joshua didn't believe, didn't want to believe me at first. He's young. He didn't grow up with the stories like the rest of us did, but he's seen it too. Said it almost got to him yesterday. Now that even Joshua has seen it, I know for certain that my eyes weren't deceiving me. Okay, so stay in the light. So I'm assuming if I'm not in the light, I'm going to die. That's perfect. That's wonderful. So, are my batteries gonna die fast then? Honey, Vanessa. 
did Vanessa come in here? I don't know if the Mananangal is able to... You've gotta be kidding me. I wonder where these cables lead. I'm gonna die now. Because I'm out of batteries. I'm gonna die now. Because I got no battery power. And Tongal's gonna get me. Please don't kill me. Come on, come on, come on. Vanessa? Vanessa! Wait, what? What was that? I hate it. I got chills. They're multiplying. Oh, hey, look at that. More of these things. That, what the? Why are these pictures even in here? This place is creeping me out. Hate it. Hate it. Hate it. Rosary, I hope God can help me too. Yeah! And like, Jesus, help me. You spared me when I saw you all those years ago. I can only hope you'll do the same now. What? I don't have any more batteries. <gasps> That looks spooky up ahead. I hate all of this. Okay, so I'm pretty sure that's the way I came, isn't it? No. It's just another cave-in, right? Is it? I'm so turned around. I don't know where I'm going. And I'm kind of freaking out. And I'm stuck on a rock. That's great. That's wonderful. Oh, they were worshipping. They were worshipping the Mananango. Which isn't too far off, okay? Because there are... Did this happen here? None of this makes any sense. Which isn't too far off, because I mean, throughout the ages, whenever there's been tales of all these monsters, whatever, like, you, you have to, you have to think, like, people are probably worshipping the monsters. Because, I mean, there's so many movies and shows that say, like, oh, we have to appease the creature. We have to make it happy. Karaboa. You can find these at most markets. We have one in our apartment. Is it, is it meant to be, like, a protector type thing, too? Or, I found the other gas tank, but I didn't find the other generator. I know there's two. Um. Maybe okay. I can go up through here. If it still works. God, I hope it does. God, I really hope it does. You know, part of me is like... I was in the light, though. Oh, F word. Oh, no. Oh, fudge crackers and lollipops. Like, what? Why would you say that? Like, did, did something, did you see something? What? To play the tape, this will expend two batteries. Nope. Kind of need all the batteries. I need them all for myself. Where's the other generator? Did I go down this way? There it is. Due to the health hazards of overexposure to manganese, all workers must wear safety masks during mining. I don't want any trouble with Mr. Mangubat. And you don't want to lose your jobs. This is non-negotiable. Overseer Mark Jacinto. Okay. That's fair. You should be wearing masks anyway when you're in a mine. Okay, so this is where the generator is. Ooh, batteries! This one needs fuel too. Oh, I thought I, I thought it was actually gonna work for a second. I was like, oh, nope. Okay, so it's back over here. Don't worry, I somewhat know where the 
fuel is. I gotta go to the shrine to the Mananunga. Why? Why are you doing what that to me? Was that? What are you seeing? I'm not seeing anything. What are you? What are you seeing that I'm not? I'm so turned around. Oh, never mind. Found it. And I'm gonna be slow walking. Oh, I can relax a little bit. Yay, I can go. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna run. I'm gonna run. That's Vanessa, red. If you can hear me, go to the elevator. Uh, but that's red. Red is usually bad in horror games. That's never a good thing. It's always bad. Hi! Oh, God! Run! 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 Oh, I'm not controlling. I'm not controlling it. <laughs> Come on, close the door. Oh. See, that's what I said. It's a half based vampire. Press the button! Wait, where's Vanessa? Is Vanessa in here? Was Vanessa in here to begin with? Really? I get nothing? I would have loved to have learned more. Like, what happened to Vanessa? What happened to my wife? I want to know what happened to my wife. Maybe I'll go travel and I'll find Vanessa myself. Oh, that was actually really fun. I like that. I like the creep factor to it. I like not knowing if it was actually gonna be following me or not. I like not knowing if it was gonna appear. That was really great. I like the spook. I like the creepy feeling it gave me right off the bat. Now this makes me want to know more about the Mananango, okay? Which is then gonna lead into me wanting to know about other monsters and wanting to see if there's other games based around those monsters. So, you know. That's going to be a fun rabbit trail to go down. <laughs> that was really fun. If any of you guys want to play it for yourselves, I will put the link down below so you can click on there and go and play it. If you guys have any suggestions for games that you want to see me play, give them to me in the comments down below. I take every suggestion into consideration. And if you enjoyed this, make sure to smash that like button. Punch, hug, kick, kiss it. I don't care what you do to it. Just make sure you click it. And if you're new here and not yet subscribed, but you're enjoying what you're seeing, why not hit that subscribe button and then click that bell so you get notified when I put out my next video. But I will see you guys all in the next one. Have a good one. Bye.